is the 27th of January 2015. We're at Vincent Corporation in Tampa, Florida. Right now we're cleaning out a little pilot plant press. Uh, we've been trying to press some seaweed. And uh, we have a number of samples we're gonna, of things we're going to run today. Uh, here is uh, some of the kelp. It wasn't seaweed, it was kelp. We have some vanilla beans to run. We have a lot of shrimp waste to run. From uh, Nicaragua, we have cassava to try and dewater. And this one, which we won't run today, is swore. It is a uh, sponge metal. Uh, we think we takes high torque, but we can squeeze the water and oil out of this. Okay, we're running the shrimp waste. And uh, we're getting some juice through the screen some press cake coming out. This is really a job for twin screw press. Uh, the material wants to co-rotate inside the press quite a bit. You'll probably see some of that there. We've definitely had better success with a twin screw press running uh, shrimp waste than a uh, one of these single screw presses. You can see how much shredding action we have inside the press compared uh, to the material going in. Anyway, we're going to uh, keep pushing this through. Um, one trouble with this 4-inch press is we've got an 8-inch opening tapering down to a 4-inch screw, so it takes a, we have to break the bridge with it. and. Uh, some real soupy materials feed fine without it, but others like this stuff will bridge. Um, anyway, we'll uh, see if we can't get a sample uh, which we'll freeze and send back. Okay, this is what it looks like um, without any steam. We're going to turn on the steam now and see what we can get. Okay, this is what it looks like with steam. Um, Probably get more pressed cake out or it's flowing a little better. And liquid, uh, hard to say how much of that is just condensed steam. Probably not nearly as much as you'd think. We're probably getting more uh, uh, liquid out of this uh, shrimp waste. We'll have moisture analysis uh, to tell us. Okay, we're cleaning out the press, getting ready for the next test. This area we're in, you'll see. Uh, Screw presses. Uh, here's a shredder, but um, lots of screw presses. Uh, we've got 200 of them in our rental fleet, and these are just the ones that have been out and come back and waiting for their next assignment. I see one there that's uh, set up for explosion proof. Um, screens for a variety of presses, and then in the background here, you can see the screw department uh, where um, we manufacture screws for all these presses. 